everyone, it's been a little while, but welcome back to my channel. Um, today I created this foxy eye look um, with like an inner corner wing as well. So if you want to see how I created this, um, just keep on watching. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. So I have actually done my base makeup um, and my eyebrows off camera just to save some time. Um, but if you guys do actually want to see um, my routine for that, just let me know and I can definitely film that. Um, but yeah, we're just going to crack on with the eyeshadow. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to prime my lids. I'm going to use the ABH eye primer. What I've been trying to do recently is like just just carve the arch of my brow and not so much the front, just so it doesn't look so harsh. Um, and I kind of like how it looks. So I'm just going to go in with the Zoeva 144 Soft Concealer Brush. Okay, so for now I'm just going to blend this part out and I'm going to use the Sigma E60 Large Shader Brush. Okay, there we go, so that's how it looks. And now I'm going to continue with the eye primer and put it on the rest of my eye. So just sort of dab it on, we don't need a lot of this because we're going to blend it in. There we go, and I'm going to take that Sigma brush again and just blend all of this out. There we go, um, my eye is primed and ready to go. So the palette I'm going to be using today is the Colourpop Stone Cold Fox palette, um, and this is what it looks like. And the first brush I'm going to use is the Colourpop E30 brush. So I'm going to take the shade Fickle Fate, um, and I'm just going to start making the wing shape. Another good uh, trick is to use like tape if you want to get a really sharp line um, but today I'm just going to be using this angled brush and I just sort of follow where my um, waterline goes. Just very lightly, just like so. And then I'm going to take a little bit more, tap it off and I'm just going to follow along my lash line. Then I'm just going to join that up with the wing that we made earlier. It doesn't matter how neat or messy you are in this step because we are going to blend everything out. Okay, so there we've got the initial wing shape. Then we're going to take the Colourpop E25 and with the shade Quarry Days, we're going to blend that out. There we go, so that's what the eyeshadow looks like, blended out. I, I'm just going to want to take a lighter shade um, and just set the rest of the primer so it doesn't crease. So I'm just going to take the Colourpop Wild Nothing palette and I'm going to use the shade Crystal Cove. It's just a really nice neutral shade and it's got some light shimmers in it, which I think are really pretty. And just softly mist it over just to make sure it's set down and it won't later on. I hope I've got the camera angle right but basically um hope that, that didn't record um so I'll tell you what I've done um and I'll show you on this side because luckily I haven't done it on this eye but basically I did the exact same thing on this eye um I did that off camera anyway um and I did a little inner wing so I'm just going to show you how to do that on this eye so you're just going to follow where your natural um lash line goes um, and sort of draw a line from there. And then you're going to join it back in to make a little triangle. God, low battery, I'm literally having so many issues today, but we move. Um, so I'm going to take the same brush and the same shade um, and I'm going to do my under eye, blend it out sort of halfway and then for the next bit I want to go really really close to my lash line and then I want to make another little wing. There you go, I think that one's a little bit obvious than the other one but um, I have a little trick that I like to do. So I take this cream shadow from Colourpop, it looks like this and with a little brush I just go back in sort of use like negative space to make it look a little bit cleaner. I 
I'm going to tight line my eyes using the Rimmel 24 hour ultimate waterproof black eyeliner. It's like this and it's like a chunky one and I find it really easy to get into um, my sort of under my lashes up here. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go in with the Colourpop Raw Beauty Christie um, Collab Eyeliner and this is the one in Woodsy and I'm going to use that to line my waterline. Now I'm going to use the Sigma Sinuosity Lash Mascara. Okay, so next we need to go in with lashes. So the lashes I'm going to be using today are these from Lashes by Kira B. So Kira is actually one of my sort of like makeup friends. Um, and I remember discovering like her makeup page ages ago. Um, and yeah, like ever since we've been like neutrals and stuff. And I remember she launched this brand um, and she does like lip glosses and um, loads of different lash styles um, brushes as well. I've got some of her brushes and they're great. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd try these out as she sent these to me very kindly. I'm just going to trim them down slightly so that they fit my eye. So I just put my lashes on and I just put some lip gloss on as well. So yeah, I just wanted to say I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'll show you a few close-ups of the makeup. Um, and if you have any questions or requests, just leave them down below in the comments. Thanks guys, bye!